few that are wavering just a little bit and thinking towards you know going back and playing? And also, what's your response to the commission when he says if something positive, real, really positive, doesn't happen by the time you get out of this meeting with the mediator, that further games will be canceled down even into Christmas? Well, the, the, your first question. Uh, what I will say is these negotiations are very serious. Although it's basketball and basketball in itself is a game, uh, this is not a game what we're trying to do. Uh, so you can fully expect that there will be differing opinions and stances and in, in how individuals feel about uh, the process that's going on right now. Uh, but you know, my job and our job, Billy and myself, Maurice, our executive committee, our job is to balance what 440, almost 450 guys want us to consider. Uh, so our job is to take into consideration all of the differing opinions uh, and values that our guys want us to. But at the end of the day, uh, there hasn't been anything um, that has become unclear in where our guys stand, and that's with us and behind us, and even if we differ in opinions at times, because that's what happens in business, uh, we, we're still together and we're united in our resolve and, and our focus in getting a fair deal done. Uh, the second point, uh, you know, that's an arbitrary deadline just to throw out uh, on Commissioner Stern's part. Uh, we don't see it that way. Um, you know, obviously, he's entitled to make a statement, uh, but it just seems very arbitrary and uh, with no real purpose other than to try to sway player sentiment. Um, I don't agree with the way it's been done, but uh, I'm not him, so I can't you know, speak to that part of it. But what I can say is, you know, for our players, you know, we've, we've made a pledge not to continue in any way to try and allow what is said or written or printed in the media or statements that will be made uh, to, to frustrate us or sway us in a way uh, to not make sure we're thinking as businessmen and we're being very smart about what it is we need to do, not only for starting the season right now, and for getting basketball back to our fans right now. But this collective bargaining agreement sets the foundation for basketball for six or seven or 10 or 15 years to come. Uh, so we can't rush through any decisions, you know, making sure we take that into consideration.